Hmm. What's going on YouTube? I'm back. Oh, oh shit. Um, oh, I need to go take a shit. I'll be right back. <laughs> I guess I want to start with reasons why I've been gone. Um, I've been gone because, you know, um, just trying to get my priorities in life straightened out. You know, I just started welding school uh, about two or three months, give or take, and it's going pretty good, you know. Like, welding is not an easy thing at all. These metals, you gotta know, like, when or what, what type of metal is good for what. Oh, jeez. A junk is super hard and frustrating at times, but I actually enjoy it. I love it. Hopefully, whenever I get done within a year and a half, uh, I'll be a bit off doing my doing the welding career, so that way it can also help with paying for school. Um, YouTube is hard. <laughs> it's hard to keep up with. YouTube is very hard to keep up with because uh, you got to make all these videos, you got to make uh, all this editing. I'm like, wow, how did these people do it for like every week? But I guess, man, keep that business up, that revenue, kind of got to. But wow, YouTube burned me out for a second. I, don't get me wrong, I love making videos. I love uh, helping people and I love being informative about some of the things that I know that I write the best on to someone else. Uh, and hopefully they can learn from it. Trying to get back into it. I have, I've been missing you too. I've been missing you guys. I've been missing all my subscribers. I've been missing all the comments. I'm missing, I just miss it all. I'm like, wow, man. I really want to get back on YouTube. I've been talking about it so much. Jeez, it's insane. Anyways, <clears throat> also another thing, you know, last time you guys seen me, I was like weighing 305. And then I recently, like, I felt like I failed. Like, I gained my weight back. I was at 330 again. Um, I, it just felt like another failed mission of mine. Um, or for me, in general. Like, you know, I I didn't, I guess there's one reason why I stepped away from YouTube because I felt like I let everyone down, you know? Um, trying to get past just the thought of, like, telling people, hey, stay consistent. Because that is the main key. It literally is. Cannot stress that enough. But, like, man, I just, just had a drought, I guess. Like, I, brought, I was like, started gaining weight. The insecurity started to come back. My clothes just wouldn't fit as right. It's so bad. Then one day, here's another little update. Um, I was playing pool. I'm a, of course, or I think I told you guys, I'm a pool player. When I went to go play in regional, which I won. Yay me, I won. I won regionals and I get to go to Vegas and compete. And I cannot wait to go and compete because uh, there's gonna be sponsors there, there's gonna be professionals there, I get to be on TV. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that because I'm gonna uh, post some videos about that hopefully. But anyway, um, I went to go play, when I, like I saw a live feed of me and I saw my stomach. <laughs> hanging down as I like squat down or as I bend over to go ahead and shoot my next shot. And I was like, oh, hell no. I am, oh, hell no. I said, I'm not gonna look like this. This is just not gonna, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna cut at all. So, change that shit. Um, another little update. I stopped worrying about body weight. I started worrying about body fat. I realized I was worrying about the wrong thing this whole time. Like, I don't want you guys to understand. Uh, oh geez. Body weight doesn't even matter anymore. Like, I, like, just, if you see that stuff, just throw that shit out. Throw that shit out the door. It don't mean shit. Well, okay. No, I won't say it won't mean shit. But, it does do not like let that be your foundation of where you are. Jeez, listen, I might explain. Okay, body weight is literally 
the weight that your whole body weighs, right? It's not even the fat that's on your body. It's calculating, you know, like the water that's in your body, the organ, nails, uh, eyes, it weighs everything, your teeth, all that. That's all that is a weight. Now with body fat, that is the uh, percentage for the, um, it's literally just the fat compared to your lean mass altogether. Um, that's what I'm worried about. I'm worried about my body fat percentage because um, at the end of the day, like you, whenever you're trying to lose weight and stuff, you'll see that you'll drop. And then there are gonna be like months and stuff where your, your weight shoots right back up or it fluctuates. Well, that can be a mixture of things, like how much water your body's holding, um, you know, how much muscle you've gained in the past, like two or three months. Um, it's just a factor of things, you know? Like your body goes through changes every day, um, and it does a lot of things every day. So, I started focusing on body fat now because, uh, I just got tired of getting on the scale and seeing that my weight went down and then as you know, it, it's like five or 10 pounds up. And I was like, why? So with our personal trainer, we just started, we got a body fat caliber. We checked mine about two or three months now. I've been training consistently. I've been eating better, eating a lot cleaner. Um, I came from 30% body fat to 28. So I've lost 10% body fat total. Well, it's actually 28.8. So the next goal right now is to get to 8%. Now, of course, not every body fat caliber is accurate. Um, you know, every body, body fat caliber is different. Um, but they all, they're gonna give you, you know, a rough estimate. But you can still find a difference in a rough estimate. So, that's, that's one good thing. That's one thing I'm worried about now. That's, I am changing, I will be changing my YouTube name. And I would not be, um, it won't be Brandon's Weight Loss anymore. I think it's going to be something about getting fit. I don't know what it's going to be. But I'm just going to change it because now I want to, every morning I get up on the scale, not every morning, but every Monday whenever I check, oh, it's just on Monday check day. I will get up, get on the scale, look at it. Is that like, what, 327? I'm like, okay. And then, you know, another Monday, it might be 323. I fluctuate between there, which is good. It's not bad because, um, as you can see from the title, the picture right here, I'll show it again. This is, like, I'm still, my weight is still roughly high. But my body, you can see my body composition is changing. And that's what I'm looking for. Uh, I don't know. I've been training hard. And there's actually, if you don't have any body fat calipers, there's actually a method for it. I will probably post a, a picture or, not a picture, but a video. And I, I also learned it from this other video or this other guy named Athlean X. He has a home method video for checking body fat. You should go ahead and check it out. I will put the, the link in my description. Anyways, you guys, I love you all. I miss you all so much. You guys take it easy. Please subscribe, like this video. I will get back to you ASAP, and I will see you guys again. Take it easy now.